hello wordpress nerds so in this video we are going to talk about get results using wpdv method so this method is used to retrieve all the results from the database table uh, using select query so it will get all the rows uh, based on the select query so in our previous video uh, we show I showed you how you can get a column um, and now in this video I will show you how you can get the entire result from the database table so if you are new to this video I would suggest to go and watch this playlist from the beginning so that you know what I am doing otherwise uh, keep continue watching so this is my local site this is my custom table for this site and uh, in this I have added my custom plugin if you don't know how to create custom plugin I have provided link into the description section and let's open this custom plugins file where i am going to add this method so this is my local repo wordpress content plugins my plugin includes and wpdb methods.php which is this so in this in the previous video i showed you get column and now i'm gonna show you get result so for the sake of demonstration i have used this wp head action but this uh, you can use based on your requirement on any other place so um first let me specify a condition so um, we will do this process when we get a query string into the URL and when we get this query string then only we will do a select result process or operation so now inside this condition i am going to use this method so which method we need to use so the method is get result oh sorry but before using that let me show you one thing this global wpdb is an object of this class wpdb so we don't need to use this syntax instead we can use this object and this is a global uh, wpdb object uh, which available in any filter or hook of wordpress so you can use this and then we can use get results so this get result accept two arguments one is the select query and another one is the output type and default output type is object but uh, let's try to get uh, use select query so select star from table so table we have defined over here which is our custom table inside this we can get the prefix of your database and i will assign this to dollar result now let's try to access the front page and here if we see that 
when we select star from this table name we get all the data from the table so using this function or method uh, we should be getting the same data we see over here in a in the object format because default output format is object and we haven't passed the second argument so it is going to be an object so let's try to pass this query string over here and as you can see this is the first and then inside this we get an object so this is first six six homi baba 35 seven bintis bb 32 just this seven bint bb 32 and so on so this is displaying entire result inside this now let's try to change format so let's start with array a so it will convert into the associative array let's try to refresh this so as you can see everything is converted into an array and let's try to pass this array n refresh this so everything converted into the numerical key then the object which we already see So all the results are converted into an object then object k I'm not sure let's see what happens object k return an associative array of raw object key by the value of each row's first column value let's try to refresh okay so it converted this um, array key as this id okay so that's the use of this object k and uh, you can use where you should use limit with any select uh, query because when there are thousands of data then it is going to be a performance issue so let's try to add a limit of two here and let's see what happens so we should get only two results over here as you can see um, then let's say I just want first name and last name so instead of star we can use first name last name So we will get this first name and last name over here and uh, yeah let me remove this so this is how you can use this get results um, based on your requirement and this is the video guys if you have any doubt or question please write down below in the comment section thanks for watching the video